Sometimes we might see a base runner get too large of a lead for a pitcher's comfort and that pitcher will turn and attempt to pick off the base runner whereas other times the pitcher might ignore the runner the runner will break for second and the defense will be able to put him out anyway and in that case he will have been considered caught stealing so let's look at the difference between these two terms of being picked off and of being caught stealing and this may be uh, the difference between these two terms might be something that you never actually pick up on but it's an important difference to know uh, perhaps if you are the one who is keeping score so the rule book really defines caught stealing more so than, than being picked off caught stealing is when the runner is attempting to advance to the second base to or second base or any base and he is uh, put out in in that that attempt to advance or the attempt to steal the base and so what constitutes an attempt basically the rules say that any move any move toward the next base base um, is considered an attempt to advance so let's say here that we have our base runner so say uh, Mark Kotze here is leading off uh, first base and he gets his lead off here we might imagine uh, this kind of imaginary line going down his body and if at any point if he even flinches towards second base then he will uh, if he's put out then he will be considered caught stealing so if he if the the pitcher turns to pick him off and mark fl flinches even an inch um, before diving back to first base if he is put out then he will be caught stealing rather than put out whereas if he makes no such movement if he's perfectly still and he di attempts to dive back into first base and he's still put out at that point he will have been considered being picked off rather than being caught stealing so the important thing to remember is that it's really completely up to the physical movement of the player there's nothing to do with if perhaps that was the player's intention or if if in your judgment you thought he was going to steal it has nothing to do with that even if the the coach has the steal sign on and you know it uh, it's it's completely up to this this uh, any movement toward the next base is considered caught stealing any mo any non movement or, or a lack of movement and being caught off the base and being put out would be being picked off